Medhurst with five goals. The impossible angle. He likes it tough. The tougher the better. What a kick. Great memories. Yeah, I had family that made this special trip over. Um, it was my first Anzac Day as well. Um, and, funny, and a few funny things leading up to the event, you know, with mum snoring on the couch upstairs and not being able to get a full night's sleep. All of these kind of colourful things um, enter into your mind when you reflect on things. I remember that Tark and Lockyer passed me that ball for my last goal. You know, I remember exactly where he was on the ground and taking that grab. I remember kicking a check side and I sort of made a bit of a fuss of it, waving off some guys that were getting a little bit too close to me. And yeah, just remember um, just the excitement, knowing my family are in the crowd too. It's always good. Oh, as a small forward, as any type of forward, if you kick a goal in the first five minutes, it adds, no matter how confident you were coming into the game, you're in the game. Um, and in a little way, a little bit of pressure's taken off. I think at the start of the game, I actually felt kind of, tended to sometimes feel a little dreamy, like a little disconnected from, from things until you physically got involved in the game. And I think once that involvement happens, you kind of feel like you're more part of the experience rather than watching it. But yeah, I remember definitely as the day went on, um, it just became more real to me. And then as you start to kick a few goals, you start to think, oh, you know, wouldn't mind a few more. And I think the moments often that end up getting captured of you in a, in a memorable setting are ones that you don't plan for. So for me, I think kicking that sixth goal, the fact that it kind of, I thought it was going to hit the post the whole way, I still don't know how it didn't. Having kicked that one, knowing I'd had a good day, knowing that we were going to win, you know, you want to include the crowd with you. You know, I didn't plan to do it, but it just felt right. I think because of the angle, the people behind me, there was like a real roar when it did sneak in and you know, that's where my attention went and um, it was nice to see their smiling faces and to be able to give them a bit of, bit of me. The winner of the 2008 Anzac Day medal polled eight votes today and it is Collingwood number seven, Paul Medhurst. I definitely had the thought before the game that I would love to win that medal. Um, and after the game, or halfway through the last quarter, I was thinking I'd love another goal because <laughs> Pendles has played really well. You know, I put it on when I received the medal, but from the night that I won it, um, you know, mum had it in safekeeping, so she's got it somewhere special in her home. But yeah, 10 years on, it's crazy. It was a special day, definitely one of the highlights of my career.